Welcome back to Yahoo Finance. Let's talk Tesla. It's officially now the most valuable automaker in the world after overtaking Toyota last week. And today, Morgan Stanley saying the bull case price target on the stock is over 2000 For more on this, we have Yahoo Finance's Emily McCormick. Hey, Emily. Hi, Kristen. And yes, after this incredible run up that we've seen in Tesla's stock over the past really just six sessions or so. We do have analysts now scrambling to offer their takes in the wake of this advance. So we have Adam Jonas of Morgan Stanley today in a note reiterating his underweight rating on shares of Tesla, but he did raise his base case price target to $740 a share from $650 previously. And as you mentioned, his bull case scenario or best case scenario for the stock would be for $2,070. And that's up from the $1,200 price target on the bull case scenario he'd had previously. That was set just five months ago. Now, the reason for this price target raise and the change in thesis here really came after Tesla reported much better than expected second quarter deliveries last week. And that, of course, suggested that overall de- demand for Tesla's remains strong, even given weakness in the auto industry as a whole. To reiterate what we saw with those figures, we had second quarter deliveries unexpectedly up two and a half percent over the prior quarter to 90,650. Now, Jonas also mentioned that Tesla may be in a position to post a profit for its second quarter results. That would actually be better than the break-even result that Tesla CEO Elon Musk had suggested in a leaked email at the end of June. Now, if Tesla is able to eke out a mild U.S. gap profit, it could be eligible for inclusion in the S&P 500, which, of course, would just broaden out the potential pool of investors who could actually own bits of Tesla stock. So those are some things to keep in mind now. Jonas did say that he does have some longstanding concerns about Tesla that do remain. Those include some concerns about the sustainability of profits in China, poor auto industry fundamentals overall right now, and what he believes will eventually be increased competition in the EV space from firms like Alphabet, Apple, and Amazon. But as of now, we are seeing Tesla shares continuing to climb, although they have paired some gains from earlier in today's session. Kristen? All right. Thanks so much, Emily. I know some people out there like myself are kicking themselves for not buying that dip a couple of months ago. Thanks so much, Emily. Hey, investors. Zach Guzman here. Are you interested in learning more about the markets and getting the latest financial news? Well, then click right here to subscribe to our Yahoo Finance YouTube channel. Get the latest up-to-the-minute market analysis, big interviews in the world of finance, and information on how to manage your money every day wherever you are.